Hello, good people. This is Portia with your word of the week to educate and inform with what I think will be the last installment on the word identity. Identity is defined as a set of distinguishing characteristics that make up an individual, making them unique and one of a kind, like none other. There's a saying that old school players used to use to get the ladies. When God made you, he broke the mold. This was said to suggest that the young lady had unique, one-of-a-kind qualities that she possessed that were so attractive that someone would have to stop and take notice. A slightly clever ploy to manipulate the desire for a woman to be recognized, but certainly not original. The one element of truth in that player's statement is that God did create each individual with a unique identity that he thought so precious, so valuable, that as John 3.16 says, he would give his one and only son, Jesus, made like none other to redeem us. The stark contrast between the player's statement and God's is a strong demarcation. God's love gives. Lust, masked as love, as the player's statement, takes. One of the amazing facets of our identity is that God so loved the world, mankind, human beings, that he gave his only begotten son, Jesus, so that we could be redeemed and not mishandled. Early Christian theologian and philosopher St. Augustine has a well-known quote, God loves each of us as if there are only one of us, paraphrased, which suggests how uniquely identifiable we are to God in his love towards us. Mysteriously, God has the capacity in all of his godness to love us in a way that makes us feel in a world full of people like we are his one and only, setting us apart in terms of identity from any other created being, his prized creation, unique and one of a kind, like no other. This has been Portia with your word of the week to educate and inform.